Okay, so hello everyone. Today we will be uh, doing a question from Gate Twenty Twenty One, which is of the subject the partial differential equations. Okay, so let's see what the question is all about. Here we are given with a partial differential equation that is second order partial differential equation that is del square u by del x square plus four del square u del x del y plus x square plus four y square del square u by del y square equals to sine of x plus y. And we have the following two statements that says P says the PDE is parabolic on the ellipse x square by four plus pi square equals to one on the ellipse this one, and the PDE is hyperbolic inside the ellipse this. Okay, and then we have to choose the given options that P and Q are true, P is true and Q is false, and all things. Okay, so when we have to tell about the parabolic partial differential equation or hyperbolic partial differential equation, we just talk about the discriminant uh, of the partial differential equation. Okay, so we are given with the partial differential equation. Uh, Okay, so we are given with the partial differential equation that is nothing is uh, plus four del square u by del x del y plus x square plus four y square into del square u by del y square and equals to sine x plus y. Okay, so uh, the discriminant we take is the Uh, we just compare this partial differential equation with the general partial differential equation that is of the form of uh, r del square u by del x square plus s del square u by del x del y plus t del square u by del y square and plus some function of x y u x u y and u. Equals to uh, u equals to zero. Okay, so just comparing uh, the given differential equation with this general partial differential equation, we will be getting as uh, r as one and s and t. Okay, so s is nothing but is four and t is nothing but x square plus four y square. X square plus four y square. Okay, so when we talk about the discriminant, we just take uh, this as the quadratic equation, like quadratic in this one, uh, and then we just like uh, skip this part. Okay, and then we just find out the discriminant of these terms that will be s square minus four r t. Okay, so if This s square minus 4 r t is equals to zero. The P D E is parabolic. Parabolic. Okay. When this s square minus 4 r t discriminant will be less than zero, we have P D E as elliptic partial differential equation. Okay. And when s square minus 4 r t is greater than zero, we will have Partial differential equation as hyperbolic. Okay, so we have to just check this discriminant of the given partial differential equation, and we'll just find out the discriminant whether it is less than zero, greater than zero. But they are talking about the two statements, which say, which says the PDE will be hyperbolic on this ellipse, which is x square by four plus y square equals to one. So we just find out the discriminant first. Uh, that is nothing but s square, which is sixteen. A uh, minus four r is one, and t is x square plus four y square. Okay, so this is nothing but sixteen uh, minus four x square minus sixteen y square. Okay, so this is nothing but if I'm taking four as common, this is minus four minus x square minus four y square. Okay, so we have to just check it out that whether on this ellipse, the given ellipse. This is equals to zero or not? So we just put this as zero. Four uh, into for uh, this uh, parabolic s square minus four r t equals to 
zero. So that implies that four into four minus x square minus four y square equals to zero. Hana. So this four can't be zero. So four minus x square minus four y square will be equals to zero. Okay. And in that case, this will be x square plus four y square. Okay. We are just doing calculations. Uh, x square by four plus y square equals to one. So we are getting that ellipse. So whenever this uh, discriminant is zero, we are getting that ellipse. It means that on that ellipse, the partial differential equation will be hyperbolic. Uh, sorry, parabolic. Okay. Okay. So we have p statement is true. So p is true. Okay. They are saying that this p d e is hyperbolic inside the ellipse. Means x square by four plus y square less than one. On that uh, region, this p d e is hyperbolic. So first we just put that uh, discriminant s square minus 4 rt is greater than 0 and we'll just find out that region nothing else okay so this will be nothing but 4 4 minus x square minus 4 y square is greater than 0 that implies this 4 minus x square minus 4 y square should be greater than 0 this 4 is greater than 0 this is, should be greater than 0 to the whole uh, whole quantity should be greater than 0 so in that case this quantity should be greater than 0 so this is nothing but 4 greater than x square plus 4 by square okay and then uh, this will be x square by 4 plus y square will be less than 1 so we are getting the uh, uh, region inside the ellipse that x square by 4 plus y square less than 1 so inside the ellipse Whenever I'm taking this partial differential equation as hyperbolic, we are getting the uh, inside region of the ellipse. So inside of ellipse. Okay. So in that case, uh, our Q statement is also true that the PDE is hyperbolic inside the ellipse x square by four plus y square equals to one. So in that case, our A option will be true, and other are wrong. Okay. So this is a question from Gate twenty twenty one. and we have to just find out the you know uh, uh, like pd is hyperbolic or parabolic or elliptic for elliptic that discriminant should be less than 0 so we just find out the nature or we can say the partial differential equation is hyperbolic or parabolic thank you